those humans it's blue pickles and welcome to or welcome back to my channel and today we are going to be doing a collab with vanilla draws i will link their channel down in the pinned comments so you can go check it out they are an extremely underrated artist and their art style is very cute so definitely go subscribe to them for this collab we gave each other one of our ocs to draw so the funny thing is we both have elf ocs with a developed elf universe and like an oc story for them so we just decided to give each other our elf ocs she gave me her oc sage nora i will explain her backstory in a moment basically there when she was younger there was a huge war between the elves and the elsh which are elven fish things and her parents both fought in the war and the war was over land and food Unfortunately, both of her parents died in that war and the Elsh won. She was really close to her parents, so it was very hard for her to go through. She was taken in by the Elf Orphanage, and she never really talked from then on. And was more of a quiet kid until one day, she ran away, which is a few years after her parents died, and ran into part of the forest where no one's allowed to go. And she got lost, and on the way, she found a girl named Alexa. Alexa's a spy. She was trying to get into the forest to see what was in there. But anyone who ever went in there never came out, so Alexa was trying to see what was in the forest, and first Sage thought she was another elf, and, then, and was relieved that she found another elf. But then when she found out she was human, it got really scared, and that's pretty much all the backstory that she has so far. This character is very cute, and I really enjoyed drawing her, except I think I might have used the wrong tones of green, the wrong shade in the hair, but it's just I didn't really have the colored markers that she used, so I kind of had to improvise a bit, but I still think it looked pretty good. Now, as you may have noticed, I have not been posting as much during the weeks at all. It's because I started school and there is just so much homework, so for the rest of the year, I'm pretty sure I'm not going to be posting as much. But I will be posting during the weekends. Um, I don't really have too much time to draw during the weekdays, but I try to during like study hall if I finish all my homework and stuff. So I try to put, post as much as I can during the weekdays, but thanks for all your guys' support anyways. and for still supporting me even though I haven't been active lately. And also, thank you so much for 700 subscribers. We are only 300 subscribers away from 1,000 and I am so excited. I never thought I'd get to this point. And about that sketchbook tour, it might, it might not be posted for a couple weeks because I tried recording it a couple times but it was like too long or I messed up too much. Yeah, that usually happens when I'm not like doing a voiceover and I can't like correct my mistakes or anything so um that should be out in a couple weeks because next week i do have a video plan i did put a pull up for that on the community tab so i already have a video plan for next week anyway so maybe the week after i'll do a sketchbook tour i don't know and the way vanilla draws eyes i just love it they're just so big and like i don't know there's just something about them that i really like now i realized in the thing she gave me in the character description that she never smiles and is never really like a happy person i guess and i didn't realize that until like halfway through the drawing I, I had already done the line art so i couldn't fix it so i'm sorry about getting her personality wrong the reference photo she gave me also didn't have the shoes so i just kind of went with some brown boots i also really like the design of the dress that she made it's very pretty i really like it i changed the sleeves up a tiny bit i'm not really sure why but i did so I really don't know what else to say, so I guess just enjoy for a bit.
for the background, I just kind of put a bunch of shapes. They're kind of based off the shapes that were in the original drawing that she made that had like kind of character information about her in it. brush tip alcohol marker is almost out of ink which i'm really sad because it's one of my favorite colors to use in my art but i mean all markers have to die at some point right vanilla it was so fun collabing with you your oc was very cute and very fun to draw thank you guys for watching like and subscribe if you haven't already and i'll see you guys next time goodbye for now